Hey guys and welcome to the part 2 of my PS5 alerts video. Today I'm going to show you how you can customize your alerts and also how to add variations such as when someone cheers or subs at a certain amount. So let's get started. First of all, let's open our PS5 alerts assets and have a look at all the files and folders we have here. You can see we have the trophies listed as bronze, silver, gold and platinum. We also have the icons for the subs, bits, gifts, raid, donation, flares and follower. I created these for you to use but you can use your own badges if you have any which I encourage you to do but please bear in mind that if you want to use your own badges you need to have them at a 72 by 72 pixel size. You can also see that there is a sounds folder which stores all the sounds for our alerts. We have the default trophy sound and the platinum trophy sound. Now back to streamer bots. Let's say when someone subs at tier 1, we want a bronze trophy instead of a silver one. First of all, go to the action for the tier 1 sub and then over at the sub actions list, you will see the group called setup. In this, you can change the values of what trophy color, title, description, sound and icon you will like. Let's edit the set argument for the trophy color and change the value to bronze. Now let's test the sub tier 1 alert and see if it comes out bronze. Awesome. For our next one, let's say we want a resub of 2 months or more at tier 1 and change the title to show how many months they subscribed for. Well, let's look at the variables used for when someone resubscribes to your channel. If you go to the resub tab under platforms and events and click the question mark icon, you will see the cumulative variable is the count of how many months a user has been subscribed. So let's duplicate the tier 1 sub action and rename it to resub brackets 2 months. I would recommend we create a new group for this so let's just add variations to keep things a bit tidy. In the sub actions list, change the title to thanks for the cumulative months. Make sure you put the cumulative with the percentage at the beginning and the end to define that it's a variable. And then let's change the trophy icon image and we will want it to show the two months badge. So let's take a look at the icon in the PS5 alerts assets folder and you'll see the two month icon image is called submonth2.png. If you have your own badges of course, then make sure you have a 72x72 72 72 image and you save them into the subs folder. Back into StreamBot, edit the trophy icon image value to the name of the two month file and then click OK. Let's keep the trophy color to silver for now. Now go back to the events tab and under the resub tab, go to add new range and choose two as the minimum and leave the maximum blank. We can now select the range in the drop down and then assign an action to it. Click it and then choose the new sub two month action. It's completely up to you at this point, but you will need to do the same for three months, six months, nine months and 12 months sub events. But for three months, for example, you will need to set the range from three to five because month four and month five use the three months badge. And unfortunately, you will need to repeat all of these for your tier two and tier three events if you want to add variations to them. It's a longer process, but it will pay off in the end. While we are at it, let's add a variation for cheers. Duplicate the cheer action, add it to the variations group to keep it tidy and then change the values in the sub action to match what you want. Mine is going to be 100 cheers or more, so I will change the badge icon to the 100 bit badge icon and then leave everything else the way it is. Over the cheer events, I will create a new range for 100 to 999 and then add an action I created. Actually, I don't want to hear a trophy sound when someone follows. I want to hear something else. So let's grab a sound file and move it to the sounds folder. Now let's go to the follow action and then edit the sub action for the sound to the name of the file. And that is really it. I would love to show you a lot more, but this would end up being a very long video. So if you have any questions, let me know down in the comments below. The best way to ask me is to follow me on Twitch over at twitch.tv forward slash Zamaxi and then ask me whenever I am live. I'm always happy to help and show you on stream. Let me know what variations you created and what creative trophy titles you made with this streamer bot tool. And as always, stay awesome and stay breathtaking. Yo,